Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we're going to discuss the moments when singers tried to hit the whistle note but failed. It's going to be a really fun video so without any further ado, let's get right into it. As you know, hitting that whistle note is not something that every singer can do. It's very difficult and a lot of good and well-known singers have failed to hit the whistle note and we're going to show you which ones. At number 7 we have the most talented and loved singer Ariana Grande. I think we are all aware of her wonderful singing skills, but obviously no one can always be perfect and everyone has some weak points. For Ariana, it can be the whistle note. She has failed many times while hitting the whistle note in her concerts and live performances, which can be a little hurtful for such an amazing singer like Ariana. Although Ariana possesses a four octave vocal range and can sing the whistle note very well, she has also hit Mariah Carey's whistle note and was absolutely perfect but she still sometimes faces difficulties when she tries to longer reach the notes in whistling voice. And I'm not blaming her for that at all, because she's such a nice singer that she does not even need to hit the whistle notes in her songs. Up next, we have another iconic singer, Camille Cabello. She's an amazing singer who has a three octave vocal range. Camille is a versatile singer who can sing any song beautifully, but after all, she is a human being and no human can be perfect even though she tries to give her best but sometimes fails, which is absolutely okay. She cannot hit the whistles, especially in live performances. She once tried to hit Mariah Carey's whistle note in an interview, but failed. She also admitted herself that she cannot hit the whistle notes. At number 5 we have Ali Brook. Ali is another amazing American singer. She has a really nice voice too, but hitting the whistle note can sometimes be a really difficult task for her. She also attempted to hit Mariah Carey's whistle note during an interview, but failed. Ali also has a three octave vocal range like Camille Cabello, and she can sing the whistle note very well, but Mariah's whistles are just way too hard for anyone. Of course, Mariah is a great legend and is the queen of the whistles, and her whistles are not easy to hit. At number four, it's SZA. Another great singer, songwriter, and rapper as well. She has sung many famous songs like Hit Different, The Weeknd, and Broken Clocks. She is an amazing singer who has a four octave vocal range, approximately, but she needs to practice a lot of her whistle notes. She has failed many times during her live performances while trying to hit the whistle note. Whenever she attempts to hit them, her voice just simply cracks, which can sometimes be really embarrassing for her. At number three, it's Rihanna, another outstanding and legendary singer. Now, as you all know, Rihanna is one of the most famous and well-liked singers all over the world. She's famous for her energetic vocals. She usually has really nice control over her voice, but sometimes she loses that control. She once lost the control over her voice and failed to hit the whistle note during her live performance, which is completely fine for a singer like Rihanna because she works very hard and some minor fails can't destroy her entire career because she's the real queen. So at number two, we have the amazing singer Normani. She is also another really good singer who has a four octave and three note vocal range, which is pretty intense. But just like many other singers, she has also failed quite a few times while hitting the whistle notes. Her voice just gets weakened and cracked while attempting to hit the whistle note or the head voice note. So last, but certainly not the least, we have the TikTok singers. There are many TikTok singers who have tried to hit the whistle notes, and I would say that most of them did it really well. There were only a few who failed, and that doesn't really count. Overall, TikTok singers did an amazing fail, and I'm very happy that these young singers are so talented. That's all for today, I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so you never miss an amazing video from us. See you next time.